Hi there, it's Adrian, VE7 November Zulu. I'm going to do another demonstration of the W6 LVP receive only loop, which I use for the low bands. Uh, today I'm picking up a ground wave beacon from uh, just a couple of kilometers away from uh, Victor Alpha 7 Mike Mike, who's active on the 630 meter band. Um, I'm going to uh, show, I'm going to rotate the loop uh, from its current position in a minute and show you the, the change in signal level. So there's the beacon. Right now we're getting S4. And when he starts transmitting steady tones, I'll start moving the antenna and you'll see how quickly the, the null moves, it moves out of the null. There we go. Okay, so I would say we had, uh, we went from S4 to uh, about 12 dB over S9. So I would say, so what's that? Uh, that's uh, five, uh, 6 dB per S unit. So uh, 5 times 6 is 30 dB uh, plus the additional, say, 12 that we saw there. Actually, it looks like it's peaking at now on 15. So 45 dB all said which is pretty impressive if you want to null out a signal, if you think about that. Um, the signal you want to null out might be a, a, an AM broadcast station, it may be a um, QRM, or more likely you're using it to null out some noise, electrical noise coming from the neighbors. So, very interesting. Um, just for reference, um, the loop antennas at uh, probably at the end of about 80 feet of uh, RG58 coax and um, the radio is an IC7610 and I'm just using a standard it's actually <laughs> overkill I think I have a ham 4 rotor up there I just happen to have a spare one anyway there you go enjoy this has been VE7 NZ